the future and see what the result of the toss was as we see the team here. Dallas Arnav Ayer, Vikash Mohan, Aditya Ganesh, Saidib Ganesh. Surprising there. Here we go. First delivery from Sanjay. Perfection. Oh, driven straight down the ground. It's a classy shot. Into the offside, gone. That dismiss. Gomel, oh, pulled into the onside. And that has gone just. He runs into ball to Bishnoi. And the ball, he gets an edge, running up towards third, and that's four runs. Pulled away from Gaurav Bajaj. Square of the wicket. Oh, slice into the offside. Fielder comes in, get hands to the ball. Top chance. And the Definitely great experience for the young man. That's slashed away. Fielder's in place. And takes it well in the end. Ducks underneath that one. Does it catch a little glove on the way through? Edge, but away from the keeper. No slip. And it's finally gone. For Garkar. This time goes short, pulled away, work to be done. And they won't win the race with the ball. It'll be back-to-back -back boundaries. Picked up, hasn't gotten all of it. Fielder in place and takes it in the end. Short, pulled away around the corner. That's going to be four. Got the line wrong. And Shubham Ranjani only too happy to cash in on that. Four runs the deep in. Don't want to build them up too soon. Bang into the gap, and that goes away for four. Was not very far away from long on, but he could not get over in time. That's a positive switch spell, but his last over went for nine. Can they do it? Does that answer your question, Shah Faisal? One bounce, and by one bounce, I mean the first time it bounced was on the terrace over Long On. Do you reckon you need to get beyond 160 as Noah's Khan starts? Oh, swung away. Wayward ball going down the leg side from Nawaz Khan. And that starts the 16th over in cover. Ranjani picks up another half century. It's gone for six. Yeah, Ugarko just missing the length. When you're bowling at the death, there's a lot more effort put into the bowling. Oh, he gets a full toss. Hammered out of the park by some yards of the battle. Shubham Ranjani gone for six. Asking for a no ball. Doesn't like this. Individual score in the Super 8 is in the 70s. Lovely strike. Straight over the offside. And that has gone for another boundary. That's ridiculous. Be the message. So Kakani gets a slice in the direction of Ugarkar, who takes a catch. And Kakani gone, 137 for five. Well, the general rule of thumb, running backwards, take contest. Brian, Brian, Brian Walter said 149. 145. Aman says 149. Down the ground this goes. And it goes away for four off the bat of Shubham. The highest individual score in the stadium this year. In the Super 8, into the hands of the man at cover. And Ranjani goes for 80. The end of the innings, it's 142. Vishnoy right there in the middle. Parwar did have a decent knock with the ball in hand. It was the pace. Four to six meter length with the new ball and slightly back of a length with the slightly older ball. Down the ground and pierces the infield. He'll pick up four runs there. Sujit Gauda made up his mind. Prepared to stay back. This one's hit straight up into the air. Chance. And dropped underneath the yesterday. And starts off giving runs today. Overpitched and greeted with much satisfaction from Sujit Gowda. That's all. He's nine. Pulled the length back. That one's gone through the infield. And the beauty of batting in the power play, once you... Rocks back in the air and in the gap yet again. It's a four to close out the second over. Brilliant from Sujit Gowda. In the air. Is this redemption? 
It is. Ranjane holds on. Ghani went for one off. Smashed over cover. We saw this so often during Major League. Sanjay Krishnamurthy gets a hold of one and sends it to the stands. Well done from Krishnamurthy. Starting to find some rhythm. That one guided behind backward point. That's the finesse. We've already seen the power, and now the touch leads to four more. So very, very lucky. It might be his day because he was put down a pretty simple catch by the man who is, oh, this goes past the man at long on, and it goes away for four. So Sujith Gauda, as I started saying, Lenny, might be feeling that it is his day. Bowler, this has worked away into the deep for four more. I started saying this bowler, Sankir Batula has looked very good this entire season. He's been essentially the best bowler for the Exporia Giants, leading the team right at 6.14. You get the sense that this pair at the top is looking good, and there is evidence of it. Sanjay Krishnamurthy, square of the wicket, goes over the top for six. Yeah, that's a massive shot over the offside. So Kakani comes in for the first time. Oh, pulled away into the stands. And that's a commanding pull from Krishnamurti, gone for six. Kakani will finish up here. Krishnamurti has really batted well. Ball going down the next side. This could be five wides, unless Krishnamurti may have got. Best of three for 21. That's cut away over the top. Can't bowl that length and line with deep or short third inside the circle. Free run. Sure. <laughs> and the Thunderbolts will be hoping that Ruben Clinton and company smashed down the ground. And that's gone for a massive six of the battle. Sujit Gauda. The scores, and I'll tell you. Oh, this one's straight down the ground. No man move just to retrieve the ball. And in a couple of balls. The attack, one over bold. 15 or 14 conceded. And he's going to concede a whole lot more here. Oh, no. Diving catch attempted at long on. Not able to. 70%, 80%. 93. <laughs> okay. Over the offside from Sanjay Krishnamurti. <laughs> and he brings up his 50. In the game, but not with these two in this kind of form. Thrashed away. Moving quickly towards the boundary rope and won't be able to get there. That cover fielder, Krishnamurti, hits the ball so matches and gonna see more of that tomorrow. As Krishnamurti's pulled this one into the leg side, into the gap yet again, trickling towards that boundary rope like it's done all night long. Four more for Sanjay Krishnamurti. Kingsman taking on the Royals in the night game. As this one's hit down the ground and straight to the man, Sujit Gauda will miss out on a second consecutive 50, but it's been a well played innings at their plans. Bolden trying to be innovative. Saideep Ganesh has opened up middle stump in Batula. This could be close. Says yes. And Kakani's taking the set. Krishnamurti. And now the discipline with the ball, conceding way too many extras. Edged. And taken, Shubham Ranjane holds on, and wicket number three in just... Well, where has this fight back come from? <laughs> Here's the run machine back in the com box, <laughs> and that's gone all the way. That's the Brian Walters magic. <laughs> Despite that little stutter in the middle, they're looking good for victory. Edged and gone. Just that one more hiccup at the end. Ranjane, the man with the ball, putting it in his spell. In the air, but it will be away from the fielders. And that's the winning run for East Bay Blazers. I'll come back for the second, but that's the end of the game. A nervous, a frustrated <laughs> little shy from Ranjane. He would have to think long and hard about what transpired earlier in the evening when they came out to field, but East Bay Blazers, it should not have been as hard as they made it look. And remember, he was dropped in that second over. Uh, and the smart. I think Batula was the pick. Kakani also bowled. Ayer, I thought, was sensational with the ball. Liru's skills in the death overs were phenomenal. We're watching the 2024 Minor League Cricket Championship presented.